Day nine. All right. Um, yeah, as I expected, the uh, first couple of days of biking were really, really hard. Um, the first day uh, that I started biking was just like even harder than I thought. I mean, it was pretty hilly. Uh, it was kind of a long climb, um, and it was just my first day in general. So I mean, that that certainly didn't help. Matter of fact, that was probably the biggest problem. Is I started the, the trip cold turkey uh, with like more or less no training at all. Uh, the long, last time I did a, a long distance bike ride was Mexico in like September. I started the trip New Year's Day, um, or I guess I started biking a couple days after that. But anyway, um, it was really hard, and I got into town um, that night. It was already dark. I mean, I was so sore I could barely walk. I was drinking as much water as I could, and I was still super dehydrated. Uh, and I mean, like, yeah, it was just, <laughs> I was, I, 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 it was pretty hard. Um, so anyway, the next day it was pretty hard to get out of bed and, and look at the, at the prospect of, of having a, another big day of biking. Um, and again, I, I expected that, uh, but still didn't make it any easier. Uh, so, um, anyway, I lost another day on the uh, trip because I had to, I basically did the first day of biking in two days. Uh, plus I lost four days because of my lost bag. So I'm five days behind right now, but that's all right. I got plenty of time to make it up. Uh, unfortunately though, most of that time doesn't come until the second half of the trip. That's when I got the, the biggest breaks I can kind of chip away at and some of the days with less, less miles that, that I can deal with. But anyway, so the first day was really hard. Second day wasn't too bad because I, I didn't, I didn't go very far. Third day was like just pouring rain all day. Um, so like physically I was, I was doing all right, but, um, Man, that rain just made it hard, and everything I had got pretty wet, even with rain gear and stuff. So, I mean, that just <laughs> that made it a pretty difficult day. But yesterday um, was great. Rain went away. Uh, you know, clouds went away too. It's nice and sunny. Today's more of the same. Looks great. Got a nice view. Um, there's my road right there. It looks fantastic. Uh, nice, nice shoulder whole way all the way. I'm all the way I'm going today. Um, so anyway, yeah, trips, uh, trips been getting going along. I'm finally getting in the rhythm. I mean, yesterday was the first day I really was like a good day. Like I was actually happy for almost all of yesterday and the days before that had their moments. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, it was a really good sign that, uh, yesterday things kind of cleared up more than one way. Um, so anyway, uh, I am on track to get into Madrid and probably four days from now uh, so I'm, I'm gonna be five days behind I think when I get in um, again not not a super big deal but um, yeah I mean that's about it oh and by the way yeah I uh, got into Spain last night uh, so officially crossed one country off the list still got a lot more to go actually not 100% sure how many more I have to go I have to look at my itinerary but I want to say maybe 13 14 more to go but hey, one out of like 14, 7% of the way done. I'll take it. Um, obviously, that's not quite right because Portugal is a very small country. Uh, but um, anyway, just enjoying the view, and I'll see you guys later.